I get hired occasionally for litigation services. And I was contacted by a company. I may have talked about this a couple of years ago. Anyway, this, uh, this woman bought a house, had a bunch of bats in the attic. I mean, when I say a bunch of bats, I, I mean like something on National Geographic. Hundreds or thousands of bats would come out of this attic every, every evening. So anyway, the, the woman was suing the previous owners for non-disclosure. Uh, ended up removing like three feet of bat guano and the ammonia in the house was just stifling. If you get involved in a bat guano kind of project and you're being asked to collect samples for the presence of uh, histoplasmosis, uh, which is the bacteria that makes you sick, just be aware that you cannot sample for that. And the reason is that the Petri dish, when you put a, a, a bat guano in a Petri dish, that bacteria is really, really slow growing. So there are other things that'll grow in the Petri dish and overwhelm it.